All right, friends, don't forget to enter the Price Cutter Football Party giveaway. We just announced our second winner yesterday, Terry Lemer. Congratulations, Terry. You go to ozarksfirst.com slash contest to enter. We're going to be giving away eight more $100 gift cards every Sunday leading up to the grand prize on December 11th, which we will then give away a Price Cutter gift card, a Traeger grill, a portable uh, fire pit, and a 55-inch television all in time for Christmas. Mm. Oh, it's so exciting giving this stuff away, but you got to enter if you can, and you, people win this, guys. We hear from them, and it's so exciting. You could be a winner, so go enter right now. You're gonna see that icon. Hit it, enter your email, and you are entered. And all of the $100 prize winners are still eligible for the grand prize on December 11th, so go enter now. That is generous. How nice is that? You can keep those or you can re-gift some of them. You could, you right? especially around the holidays. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying. And it's always great to see our friend Travis Birch Hi. with Price Morning. Cutter. And, you know, Halloween a week from today. Yes. You brought back our best friend from last I did. year. I came with company this morning. Mr. That is scary to see that in your car, probably. Well, I keep them boxed up just to keep the other people from being scared. Yeah. <laughs> he made a splash last year. People were really all about that guy. Does he have a name? I haven't really named him. We could Meathead? probably do a poll. Meathead. Meathead's Meathead, a good I like one. that. Yeah. What is his name in the movie? In P Pinhead? Pinhead. Pinhead. Mm -hmm. That's it. That works too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we could call him Burger Man or Burger Man. Just scary man. I did yes. make that out of burger uh, smoked sausage sticks is what I used on that last year. So. Uh, that is, that's awesome. Hey, but something good fun news to do. is, yeah, it is, if the apocalypse happens and you're trapped in a storm cellar, you've got some food. I'm telling you, I eat it. I would eat it. Yeah. <laughs> if you had to. I had to. Before I ate squirrel. It's that's all there. there. I'm just Between saying. Between the uh, fruit roll-ups and the olives and the cheese. And <laughs> Yes, that's and so good. And the toothpick to pick it out of your teeth. Right, You're see, so you got it all. So creative. So what did you bring for us today, Trav, for well, Halloween? I just brought some fun snacks that I thought maybe I would share with everyone. Yeah. It's starting to be that season where things are kind of changing. You're seeing different things on the shelves. So I thought we'll just start on that end down there in the front, Jeremy, with that, uh, with the research pumpkin mousse. Mm. Something that's, uh, obviously, it's pumpkin season. So everything is pumpkin spice and pumpkin everything. So Pumpkin mousse. How do you eat that, Trav? You can use uh, graham crackers, which I've oh, got some there if you want here's to try to see. Do you remember last time we tried the pumpkin hummus? Yep. Yes. I'm wondering how this differs from the, because we love the pumpkin hummus. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, that's good stuff. Oh, I just, just want a little bit. I think you'll like it. I'm Let's sure I will. It's almost like a pumpkin pie filling, obviously. Who wouldn't like, love that? Yeah. That's so good. That's better than pumpkin pie filling, in my it's opinion. It's good. Like that. It's, it's fluffier. Pretty, it's fluff. I it's like so that better. Good. That consistency. That's yeah. really good. Oh my goodness, that's yeah, great. Yeah, it's, oh. uh, it's good. Mm. It goes on lots of things. I think it's best with the uh, with the graham crackers. I agree. Mm -hmm. I agree. I By the sweets. way, too, guys, yeah. if you get this one, get that little can of ready whip. Okay. A little whipped cream on it too. I'm gonna Party. Visit this. Yes. Yeah, so good. Exactly. Party. Good times. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll move on a little further there with the cheeses. So there's several different cheeses that are out there. Um, now some ideas that I've seen. I didn't have time to do it. But you know they make little smaller cookie cutters for different holidays. Mm -hmm. yeah. You could take cheese like that and press those through and make little witches or ghosts mm. or pumpkins Aww. or whatever, and then put that on a cracker and make it just little Great like a, idea. your own little charcuterie tray. So I love that. Um, there's Holy all different kinds of goudas and spices and flavors and cheddars and Yummy. try them all. Mm -hmm. Can I see? I love these crackers so yeah, so much. Mm -hmm. good. These crackers are so good. My favorite thing to do is get like a the borson cheese mm -hmm. and just dip that into the borson mm -hmm. cheese, and it is. To die for. Yeah, yum, it's good yum. stuff. Good Let's stuff. have a nice snap to them. Yeah, so oh, they're yeah. really good. Yeah, they're yeah. perfect for snacking. Yeah. So then also some other items here moving on to these containers. So Gordo's cheese dips, those are in the ad this week. Mm -hmm. Now those are the ones there that you can just take that container, warm warm it up in the microwave, and then you can just you could serve it from the container or you could put it in, in another dish if you wanted to. Easy, easy peasy. So there's three different flavors for everyone's taste palates. Yeah. So you can those Ooh, so easy. Which is good stuff. Ponchos, which we've talked about before with the queso and yeah, then the yeah, regular there. Mm -hmm. the, those are just a cold dip. Again, I recommend using guys' chips, even though it's a, it's a you would think tortilla chips, but I think it's just a guy's regular old potato chip. It's best. With you convinced me last time, Trav. Yeah, it's a game chip. I didn't know about it until like you it. said, do it with the guys' chip. I'm like, but I need a tortilla chip. You're like, no, let's try it. Yeah, it's a great mixture. What, what is this? Are they different flavors? Here, do you want to open that one? This is the yeah. original, which That's I think the is the best. Okay. Is it okay if we open this trap? Yep. Here you are. Let's do some chips. Oh, we got to get a chip with it. Yes, there you go. Oh. There we go. That looks lovely. All right. Love these hearty guys' chips. Mm. Are, you want there half of that go. or you want Oh, it? thank you. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Look at, oh, be careful not to break oh, the chip. Oh, it's nice though. and thick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good stuff. I mean, I was telling you that. Mm. You could almost eat a whole bag, if not two bags, just on that container. And you could use that second. in burritos and stuff when you're home making mm -hmm. stuff. That's this is, really good. And so what you could also use, so... And I meant to bring them today, but there's you see some tortilla chips in the stores now that are like uh, black and orange. Mm -hmm. So you could make little nachos mm -hmm. if you want to do those with you know you could use the Dos Rios taco meat, which we've talked about before. 
some mm. of that on top and the other toppings, and you're ready to go. Yes. You know what's crazy, Trevor? I grew up in Dallas. Uh -huh. There was a Mexican restaurant called Poncho's that my brothers and cousins I loved. Mm -hmm. This is taking me back to Poncho's. Oh, it's taking me back. It's, it's taking me back. You know how it's a memory. It's bringing yeah. back a right. memory. Yeah. Because it reminds me of going after after church. It's to so Poncho's. Good. There's no other dip out there like it. I love it. And you can see so the cold one and then the Gordo's cheese with the hot one. It's uh, yeah. they're 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 really good. Vegetables. You can dip those in. As oh, well. yeah, that'd be good. cauliflower. Cauliflower, broccoli. I should have I should have uh, brought some cauliflower. No, it's a we're, good we're, idea we're, though. We're good. Yeah. Like the guy's chips are good. So then also in the ed with with just little salad sides. Reese's are in the ad this week. I just brought a few. I know yeah. typically people think of summertime for a lot of that, but it's also already done. So if you yeah. wanted to, like in front of it there, a tri-tip that's in the ad starting on Wednesday, you could smoke that for the group if they want to do that and have some dinner for everybody. Yeah. Well, these are, I appreciate the small size for like maybe one person. This mm -hmm. would be one sitting for me. These yeah, so right. Good. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> I mean, I understand that. they come in larger sizes. Oh, yeah, absolutely. absolutely. They come in the big three pound tubs. So, then moving down a little farther with the uh, Zatarans, is something else that's in the ad. You know, we're moving into jambalaya type season. Mm -hmm. So, there's some options there with that, with the uh, Cajun sausage and the boudins. Mm -hmm. uh, Boris hot dogs is in the ad this week, too. I know you could do some fun treats with those and make them look like fink, severed fingers. Oh, yeah. Like oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the past. yeah. Or mummies. Fun for the kids or mummies. Mm -hmm. Yep. Love that. Meatballs. So, some you could just throw in a crock pot, a little barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. And again, just finger foods for the kids to eat before and after. Yeah. I love just meatballs. Even though meatballs. they want to be in the candy jar. So you might yeah. to <laughs> uh, and then, of course, guys' chips. We talked about that before. Um, a snack mix is another option, too. You know, a lot of people are going to have parties at work or, uh -huh. or around their house. So that's another option there that's got everything from Cheerios, pretzels, um, cheese balls. It's got uh, peanuts in it. With their own little spice mix, so yeah, I didn't try this stuff. Well, you... what's funny is when he brought that in, it was completely overflowing, and everybody's been eating it during the commercial. <laughs> yeah. So I apologize, Trav. It's so good. Okay. It's, it's addictive. What it's, for. it's addictive. Yeah. It's so good. Man. This proves the point. The spice on there is so mm. delicious. Mm. Yeah, it's easy. I love that spice. Whatever flavoring mm. that is, that I they keep put that on in there. the car. So when I'm driving around, I that's usually that my is snack. good. And it all comes in this bag, or this is just a uh, yeah. This is yep. No, that's just the, the tasty. Oh, that's amazing. Which is good stuff. And again, of course, Mr. Pinhead brought him. <laughs> uh, with burgers, so there's also uh, summer sausage, snack sticks, and everything like that you could make chartreuse trays with, with that cheese down there. So. Oh, I love that cheese. Plenty of options. Oh, oh man, but it's I, so I'm good. I'm gonna have to dive back into this. This pumpkin puff or whatever you're pumpkin calling. I'm moves. diving back into pumpkin the cheese. Yes, yeah. man, this is I'm good. Gonna go sweet. Jeremy's gonna go savory, mm -hmm. but you can do both. The price cutter. Look at all the stuff they've got for your great parties or any mm -hmm. time of year. Yeah. Travis, we we love you. We, th oh, we thank you for okay. coming in. And hey, happy Halloween! And tell I, Tinley we said hi. I yes, will do that. Do I that. will. Okay. I will. See you next time. Yep. Thank you. We'll be back right after this. Is mm. Tinley dressing up this year? Yeah, she's gonna be a cowgirl. Ooh. Yeah.